Welcome back to uh, Life is Strange. Now, when I was away blowing my nose, I checked for the recording dump folder and I realised we're now five videos into this series based on how long I've recorded. And we've only done two major objectives in this game. All we've done, well, we haven't even done that, we've only done one. All we've done is save that girl's life. We haven't even got the memory stick to Warren yet. So I think what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to start making these 30 or 40 minutes long. Because if I keep going at the rate of 20 minutes a video, which is my usual rate, this series is going to be like 40, 50 videos long. I ain't got time for that. Well, I have, but I mean... I love my space, you, you but I do miss my friends and family in Seattle. I'm talking, you fucking bitch! Anyway, I'm pretty sure you won't like it if it was 40 or 50 videos long, because then I'm, you know, I'm elongating it longer than it should be. And you've got to wait longer for the ending then. So maybe 30 minutes of video now. I'll add 10 minutes of video, so every two videos will cut it down by a video. Uh, that makes mathematical sense to me. I'll let you work it out though. <gasps> Can I take a selfie? Hard to believe I'm 18. Do I yeah. look any older? Just more stressed. Oh, it's, hmm. No, let me. I can't. Let me zoom out. Let me. Let me age guess you. Based on how you look. All right. So you're 18. Uh, I would say she looks more 16 going on 17 though. Or is it just me? She she doesn't look 18. But oh well. Alright, let's take this selfie. I had to shut my microphone then. I was, I, was got, I was about to think, oh shit, have I turned my mic on? Yeah, tab. Is that a picture we needed? Oh no, but... Oh, I've missed three pictures. Oh, I'm... I've... I'm so triggered by the fact that it took me to this place. It said look at the sign. It didn't say go to the sign. Go past the sign, whatever. It just said look at it, so I looked at it. Is there any more journal, journal entries? Wait. Uh, I got more reading, guys. I felt so shitty, I wanted to just get to the bathroom to be alone and wash my face after that nightmare or daymare. Once I got to the bathroom, I saw this odd beautiful blue butterfly fluttering and right when I took the photo of it in the corner Nathan Prescott came in freaking out talking to himself I hid in the corner and this punk girl came in and they started arguing about drugs and money the same thing is that punk girl yeah she's no better than him he might have been she might have been accusing him of dealing drugs to the kids in the school and stuff but she came in arguing with him about getting cash to hide that information she didn't give a shit about ratting him out she just wanted money and then she fucking chickened out when he pulled the gun on her. What do you expect? You can't deal out that shit to him. When you know he's like that anyway. And not expect something back in return. She's an idiot. She's just as bad as him. Then Nathan actually whipped out a gun and shot the girl. If I come across punk girl again, I'll tell you something now. I am not, I am not friending her. She's not going to be a friend. This is very strange. When Nathan fired the gun, I came around the corner and reached out for some dumb reason. As if I could stop the bullet. It's just subconscious bullshit in it. But suddenly I could feel the world twisting around me and this pressure in my head. Everything seemed to rewind and I found myself right back in class at my desk. See, that's my theory about the uh, the lighthouse. I reckon that's one of the endings of the game. And it was such like, uh, about to die, it was such a, like an adrenaline filled moment that she somehow managed to unlock that and rewind it all the way back to the start when she found her powers. I literally thought I'd just be dosed with some drug until I can't calm myself down. I saw everything happen in class the way it did before. Although no, thinking about that theory, she would remember it, wouldn't she? She'd just love the stuff from the story, Anna. So maybe it was a dream of maybe a foretelling or something. I don't know. Major Groundhog Day deja vu. Somehow I was able to actually rewind time. Eleven. I knew the only way to find out if I was having a breakdown was to go back to the bathroom and see if I could save that girl from Nathan. Of course, we actually used it for evil first. Because, you know, life. I have no idea how either. I just knew I couldn't live with myself if I let her die again. I escaped Jefferson this time by knowing exactly how to answer his questions and rushed to the bathroom. I hid in the corner again and I couldn't believe it when Nathan showed up freaking out all over again. Then the girl came in the bathroom and, be 
and before Nathan could shoot her, I smashed open the ancient fire alarm and scared both of them away. Victory. <laughs> She's like, yeah, victory, after being evil. Until I got grilled by the security chief, who is a fucking idiot. He's like, girls use that excuse all the time, but girls have that excuse to go to the bathroom all the time. Who thinks he's Chuck Norris, Blackwell Ranger? Uh, Nelson Prescott almost kills a girl in the bathroom, but no, I'm the problem. But so the thing is, people didn't see that though, and you kind of reverse time to make it not happen, so it never happened. It only happened for you. So I'm just point. This is the problem. I, when I play stuff, I will point out the logic. I can't. I'm one of those people that I can't do suspension of disbelief. It was. I was so glad when Principal Principal Welsh stepped in to shoo David away. I mean, he couldn't have done anything to you, he's just a security guard. You can't use lethal force on you. Oh wait, no, it's America. My bad. I wanted to inform Principal Wells that I saw Nathan waving a gun in the bathroom, but I didn't want to mention the girl or my new rewind abilities. Well, you didn't have to, it's just the fact he owns a school. You could have said it, but the school wouldn't have done shit, would they? Why the school? The school that is practically built and funded by them. Well, not built by them, but you know what I mean, it's maintained by them over the years. And not gonna grass out the children because then they lose the funding and the school fucks off. It's as simple as that. That's the reason why we're here in the first place is because it's being funded. I wouldn't know how to tell him without making me look crazy. He grilled f he grilled me for being out in the hall during the fire alarm. I'm still glad I didn't have to tell him that Blackwell's most big fucking deal student actually killed a girl in the previous timeline. Mm. But it wouldn't have washed anyway because she, she's still alive. So my school day started with an apocalyptic dream and then ended with a, saving a life and discovering I had some kind of power to rewind time. I don't know how to top this. Ah, oh, isn't this? Uh, didn't the science teacher mention something about? Sorry, as I'm reading this, I'm going over what we know in my head. Didn't the science teacher, Miss Grant, who I hope we get a lesson with at some point because she sounds fucking amazing. Didn't she say that this is like some ancient Indian? like Native American Indian like site that we're on. So maybe this is like some sort of like Native American spell maybe? I don't know. I'm going too far ahead in the fucking storyline. Let's just see. Everything feels so surreal right now. I could talk to nobody about this. Well, the only person I could, I haven't seen in five years, I could confide in Warren. Please confide in Warren. He loves you. I'm pretty sure at this point he loves you but your friends owned him. He's smart and knows science, so maybe he could even think of an explanation. Though I have no idea what that could be. Until I can figure this out, I'd better stay out on the down low with this stuff and focus on my classes. Well, I mean, you can still use it for evil, right? Did you actually get an answer wrong on your test? Rewind time, slip that answer in. Perfect score. Yeah? Warren sent me a text asking for his flash drive back, even though I haven't had a chance to check out all the cool shows and films on there. I watched a few episodes of Doctor Who, yes, Doctor Who for the win, and X-Files, binged on Full Metal Jacket Alchemist, and then Faster Pussycat Kill Kill. All kinds of Amazon woman, black and white badassery, I don't know what that word is, and Scott Pilgrim. On a side note, I saw a missing persons poster on campus for Rachel Amber, a pretty Blackwell student who vanished. It's so sad to see her smiling face and think about the awful things that could happen if there was a way for me to rewind back six months. I totally would. But you didn't get your power six months ago, so you won't be able to rewind that far, will you? I had to go back to the dorm to get... In fact, she wasn't here six months ago, clearly. I had to go back to the dorm to get Warren's flash drive and yes, because... <coughs> Fuck it, I think I got a cold. Between, between the first three videos to this one I've somehow developed a cold and he even took my picture it was so high school movie I can't believe she did it she actually told me to go fuck your selfie though it was funny I mean, it was pretty funny I don't know why she had to act that way she already has everything she wants doesn't she and she forced me to use my rewind until I finally came up with a way to get her out of my way I don't want to use this power for trivial bullshit. I mean, you've used it for evil already. Just fucking go with it now. You've done it. You might as well just carry on. The sin's been done. Just keep sinning. Uh, especially if I have to be... Especially if I have been given an actual gift from the universe. But I did give me a chance to test it. Yeah, it did give you a test to test it. Sorry, I keep reading it wrong. Dyslexia and shit. 
But I felt like shit seeing Victoria sitting there by herself on the steps covered in paint. She didn't look like the Queen Biatch of Blackwell. Just a lonely girl as confused as me. I knew I had to find out if she was okay. She was actually nice. And she wasn't nice. She fucking... She was a little bit catty in her reply. You could hear it. And apologise. She even deleted the picture she took off. She took off me. She took off me in the phone. So maybe there's hope for the future. Now what we're doing is... Right, let's back out of this. Now what we're doing is, look. We're her friend. But we're not her friend at the same time. So we're friend when we need to. But we don't like her. Comprende? How do I get back into that journal? Is there anything else? Right. If anyone wants to, uh, has has a gander at his profile, pause the video. There you go. And uh, there's Sergeant Buzzcut. What a dick. I got. Oh, I forgot we had a message off, Mom. Hi, honey. Your principal sent me an email saying that he's concerned about your attitude and behaviour. Fucking principal, man. What a wanker. Fuck him. I'm not reading the rest of that. Triggered. It's a note. Warren even left me a little message with to his Ma flash drive. To Max or whom it may concern. Goofball. The cinematic contents of this flash drive are of a graphic, life threatening, controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care and if the most. <laughs> oh dear. You see, Warren sounds nice. Cannibal Holocaust. Ah, I hope that's a real film. I want to watch it. it sounds awesome. It's a Holocaust with cannibals. It's a teddy bear. Hello, teddy bear. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. I I remember that day. When I saw that... Uh, that was a rubbish... Even I realised that was a rubbish pirate accident then, so I stopped. I literally... My, my subconscious brain cut my conscious brain off from speaking. I said bad it was. Uh, no, I don't turn them off. Turn them back on. But no, turn them off with saving electric. Oh, oh, fucking! Oh, please don't make this be a cutscene that skips it to another part of the game. Hmm. I'm gonna keep making that mistake, aren't I? Oh, no. It's just a lady. Oh, it feels so nice to just relax. Yeah. This day has been so damn bizarre, and it feels like it has gone on forever. If you get a lie on your back like I'll that, just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Shut up! I'm talking. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Bwah. Sorry, I couldn't resist inception. If you're going to lie like that looking at your ceiling, you might, why don't you stick a post up there or stick your pictures up there? Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Oh dear. There's a guitar there, but we'll get to that last. We'll go clockwise, uh, carrot clockwise, sorry. There's a cushion. So cheesy, but it makes me Something. smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that oh, together. Yeah. It's got, it's got some nice hand drawn flowers on it, it's great. Oh look photos, let's look at them. The oh this is for the picture. Photo memorial wall. This is for the picture to start, isn't it? She's standing here with the lights on. Who took the photo for oh, I guess uh I guess one of the girls took it for her. <sighs> Max and Chloe. Oh, is Best that Chloe? Forever. Oh, I look Who even says that anymore? They look like such I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. They look like such good friends, though. You know when you see two friends together and you think those two are made to be the best friends ever? Yeah, that's what they look like. They look like Max and Chloe were meant to be. Ah, oh, that's so sweet. Uh, is this copyrighted music I if I play it? I should the thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? I don't, don't care. It's, it's music inspires me in my photography. Did you just say dollar? It's not... Where's the vinyl on it? I don't see no vinyl on it. Why would you pick up dollar vinyl? There's no vinyl. What the fuck? Kids these days, man. I don't know what they're talking about. Alright, let's stop that because it might be copyrighted. Cartier Bresson, do I know? Hamilton, the greatest. Yeah, I have no idea who you're on a bit. More photos. That's the only oh, tourist that picture I let them take of me. Is that your dad? Needle. He looks like a fucking lumberjack. No wonder Seattle's got no trees of people like him around. That was a good hockey game and a nah. great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Trail. <gasps> it's Harambe! He lives on. Dick sent for Harambe. Here's my go to source for instant photo inspiration. Well, let me have a look. Yeah, you Philip used to take Philip Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. 
I can't see the page. Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. I mean, no, oh, you can only, I was about to say you can freeze time, but you can't, you can only rewind it, you fucking noob. Wait, no, let's not use the laptop yet because it's, uh, it's got the stick, hasn't it? What's in this drawer? <gasps> I just noticed that says cookies on it. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Oh, is that your dad's camera or something? Is that your dad before he grew he grown a weirdy beardy? Let's be honest, you, your dad grew up to be more handsome. So that's a plus. Or is that just... Uh, that might, might just be a generic front. But it's... <coughs> fucking cold. It's the same camera she's got, though. So... <gasps> Cookies! Can we have a cookie? Oh, shit. Cookie. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate mm. coconut bites for my birthday. Ah, oh, coconut as well, so and fucking nice. And slipped in a two hundred dollar gift certificate. Two hundred dollars for she more cookies. She should make a sad birthday happy. You could buy two hundred dollars worth for more cookies. What more can you ask for? It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. Hey, you don't have I to like wear my wardrobe. Just because you're a girl, you don't have to wear pink. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? It's a bit gaunt, any in the face. <gasps> Can we play the guitar? It's yeah. such a pretty guitar. Oh, guitar. I need to play it more. Yeah, super mega ukulele. Can anyone name that reference in the chat? Please tell me, Blue. Guitars and shit. I'm not very good at making lyrics. Especially when it's in a tempo. Because I'm not that good at music. I'm gonna say all this in the same key. La la la. <laughs> I'm gonna drink my coffee while she plays it. I apologize for the slurping in the mic. I might just mute it in After Effects uh, after Sony Vegas afterwards. In fact, now I'm gonna leave it in to make you guys suffer. You have to s listen to me slurp for like half a minute now. Are you enjoying that sound of me slurping? This song is going on forever. Put your fucking guitar down, bitch. You're playing the same fucking riff over and over again as well for a start. Change it up. Your music's nearly as bad as Justin Bieber's. Oh, can I exit? Oh. <laughs> All this time I could have exited myself. Fan fucking dabby dozy. Oh dear. There's a, there's a book. Let's have a look at this bookies. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. I have no idea I what this is. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. What's this? I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Yeah. Go Thunderbirds. Thunderbirds, I'll go. That's Instant the, what film I think of. is so damn hard to find and expensive now. That's because it's all digital now. I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. Get with the times. Well, first off, oh, sorry, I just realised something. She goes on about buying this expensive damn film back from the analog days, but then she says about buying vinyl dollar, dollar vinyl. She doesn't have a vinyl fucking player. Jesus Christ. Do you even know what you're talking about? You was born too late. I know all this shit. I'm like 23 in the... Oh, accidentally rewind. I'm like 23 soon. Like in like two or three months or whatever. I don't know, I can't be asked to do the maths. I've seen shit. I remember dial-up, you don't. So look at the window. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking hand through still. a window. Always looking. It's like me coffee. What's that called, Harman? Oh, the way that was then, I thought it was called the vinegar and the cow. It's called the vinegar and the cow. Mmm, <laughs> the vinegar and the cow. Okay, I'm sure that I'm sure that water bottle was highlighted before, was it not? Or did I just confuse it? I must have confused it. I oh, know it's because I saw it down here. That's why. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. 
Drink What's up. I'm the, Hold on. I'm the worst baby mama. What fuck is kind of sentence is that? How is water in a plant going to fucking have consequences? I don't understand. Is it going to grow fucking more pandas and kill me? I haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. Oh, she's given a plant to... You realise the plant can't hear you. You know that, don't you? It has no audible senses. One day I'll organise my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HDTV. Uh, you don't... Listen. When I was young, we used to have these... Thi camera kit for your face. Nope. Oh, when I was young, we had these things called... C CR oh, I'll just get in your face. Called CRT, and they were square, and they were massive, and they were low def. And I still watched all the great films on those. Watching them on HDTV doesn't enhance the experience, it just makes it look prettier. A good film's a good film, regardless. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Hey girl, I borrowed your drive. Ah, oh, fuck it, we gotta go, we gotta go on another quest to find this drive. What a bitch. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. There's my poor laptop begging me to check in. Is that, this, this has a gander on your laptop. I'm I am so addicted to this site. I'm starting to like Max Look now. Look at these vintage beauties. Max is alright. No, oh, camera porn. That is totally a chrome ripoff, by the way. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Thank you for the email and copy of Jefferson's class notes. Now I shall uh, blah 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 blah. I'll let you read that yourself. Fucked up films and fat drive. Ah, uh, Warren so wants her. But as I was saying, Max is pretty cool. I've decided I like Max now. Pretty cool, aren't you, Max? Yep. So I guess we've got to fucking go out the room now and find this drive. Let's go, bitch. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Fucking what's happened now? Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. I also can't get used to the camera controls on this. It seems to change the direction of WK. What are you doing hey, to my Juliet, girl? Huh? Is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What are you to do to my busy? You are ridiculous. She's your friend, bitch. She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, I mean, probably not. He may have done it to her out? first. Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. There's only like a cat you with me, you bitch. Name? Let's guess. Please be Patson. Juliet Pats. Juliet Patson. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Yes, but I'm going to use my rewind powers for, for evil now and just... Oh no, what's this? Oh, I know your last name now. Hey, oh, Juliet. Yeah. Is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. Juliet Watson, you be nice. Lol. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. I didn't, but oh, I rewound time and do. found it out. Thanks. And I locked Dana game. in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Yeah. Unbelievable. Oh no, these are two Vortex Club douches, aren't they? Would Dana do that, though? Would Dana do that? She's According a cheerleader, probably, Victoria, but Dana still. Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. Ah, uh, a cheerleader, According yeah. To Victoria. Oh, no, Victoria's oh. evolved. It's all she bullshit. She saw the sex, and Zachary won't answer his phone. <gasps> Victoria's Once Dana admits it, she can dorm go. room door's open, isn't Straight it? To hell. Oh. Sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Sneaky, sneak! Ah oh, man, her room's fucking cool. Look at this shit. God, I'd totally be friends with Victoria if she wasn't a bitch just because she's got so much money. Well, that says more about me than Victoria. Oh, so I thought there was a nuclear bomb at first. It's Pierre uh, burning dead. Dior, Givenchy. You could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe. Yeah, but she owns a school remote, so she doesn't need to pay shit. Those boots are made for walking runways. Yep. That is a tasty plasma. Maybe I could sneak in and watch Final Fantasy Spirits Within. Lol. I don't care what anybody says. That's one of the best sci-fi films ever made. Uh, no. 
self what did this pay you to put that in the fucking game? Either way. You don't want plasma, plasma's rubbish. No one uses plasma anymore. Ooh, whoa, 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 what the fucking camera. Use OLED or normal LED or L C D. You don't use plasma, because it's heavy, uses shit tons of electricity, and they break really easily. Oh man, this is so wrong. I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article. Oh, I can't be asked to read that voice it's slip shit. Go fuck themselves. Let's have a look around her. Oh she's got a teddy bear. Oh fucking I'm stuck again. The camera controls in this game are so wank. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. So Victoria's got something to do with it, or at least a family. Cause I mean, a family this rich, come on, they've got to have connections somewhere, yeah? Maybe Victoria got someone in her family to send up an order to get rid of her. I'm just saying. Don't judge me Victoria in the comments. I'll see you people judging me. Groupie. Yeah. It's a douche head teacher. I don't care about you. Before I check that, I need to look around your shit. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Oh no, I can't see it. It's too small on my screen. What's this? Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. Why well, she got it in her own room, though? No, officer, I'm not snooping. Just admiring Victoria's cutting-edge tech. They should call this series aloof. Cold and soulless. Let's use that. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Whoa! Maybe I will join her posse. Oh, I'm so jelly. 3D printer. This camera. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. Could you not simplify I that for me, please? You, Victoria. Could you have just said it was a digital SLR that shoots in RAW? That would have made sense to me. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Oh, uh, rejected bitch. Unlike me. That's what you get for being a bitch. You get rejected. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the chase space. Color me impressed. Well, you gotta remember, they're rich. They had to have got rich somehow, hadn't they? They must own things to get rich. <gasps> Gotta mess it up. Let's play a little photo Tetris and leave Victoria a message. I'm Let's leave a message on your face. Here. And this one there. I mean, Victoria's face, not Maxi Max's hmm, face. Forget pattern it. is emerging. <gasps> is this what? Is this a photograph? Let me have a look. Yeah. Boink. Stop. I swear to God, if you shake the Polaroid one more time, you're not supposed to. Even I know this, I'm not even a photographer. So, we've, yeah, we're still on track. We've missed something that happens with the football next, then. So, I need to keep an eye out for that. But we've missed these three. I hope we can go back and take them. I think they're gone forever, though. Oh. I'm not happy with that sound I can hear. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. I'm confused by that. It's like a mixture between Facebook and Twitter. Because this is kind of Twittery and that's kind of Twittery. That's Facebooky. That's Facebooky. And that's Facebooky and all that. But that's Twittery. Does that Boom. make sense? This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print So sad to inform you that I totally punked Juliet and Dana just now. All I had to do was mention the words. Yep. Let's, uh, let's print that. Can I go back? Is it going to print automatically? Why have I got printed for? Why don't I take a, a picture with my phone? Because now I've left evidence as ink be used and it's going to show up in the print history on the fucking computer. You dumb... You dumb bitch. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. You just left evidence it's going to print... Oh, God damn it. I can't even be asked. Let's go. Oh my God, I just... Imagine if Victoria was standing right there then. Run, don't trip on the bug roll. Run. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. 
Now let's see what Zack has to say about I mean, she left the door open. I didn't really you do anything. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. I mean, you kind of took it without asking for a start. It should be you I'm bitching about. But I'll let it go. Almost <gasps> done. I get to sleepy, sleepy, sleepy. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. No. What we do, what we do, Max, is we snoopy snoop. You get snoopy snoop, you get all the deets. And then if you, you can use those deets in the future to win. Also, I just realised how evil I am. Not the character, I mean me behind the computer. As myself. I don't know why you guys subscribed to me for a start. Cheerleader I can't outfit. even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. Well, the first thing you need to remember is you don't need to have a brain to be a cheerleader. It rules you out already because you have one. Dana takes her Blackwell spirit seriously. Let's have a gander. Oh, she's got a nice fan there. No, we're not looking at her yet. Let's use laptop. Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. I was going to say, she's got more... It's so Ooh. fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. She's still got a thingy and up in there. Yes, Max. So terribly wrong. I was going to say, she's got more than Victoria by the looks of it. By my reckoning. <gasps> What's that? That looks like a home pregnancy test. Why does it give me the option to take it though? Why would you take someone's home pregnancy test? It's clearly negative anyway if she's chucked it down there, so I'm going to leave that. I'm not evil to her. This is both sad and pathetic. Hold on. Dana, I suck at writing, but I thought I should write this so you might not hate me, my dumbass forever. La 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 la. You saw how I pussed it out. He can't even write, fucking hell. How is he even in college? I don't understand how he's in this college then, if he can't even write properly. It would be a cool sticker without the words. Because, hold on, surely you have to, like, for, so based, based on the journal, she said Blackwell's prestigious here. Yeah? I mean, it's owned by rich people, and they essentially pay the scholarships and shit. So you've got to be, have good grades to get here, yeah? So why are the stupid jocks here? I don't understand. I'll speak to you in a minute. I'm snooping around. <gasps> Pringles! Right. I don't understand why I could take that, but still, I'm not going to take it. Let's have a look at her. Dana really does look stressed about all this. Let's ask her. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria's Victoria not nice. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Yeah. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. Ah, uh, but he's been friend zoned. It's too late. <laughs> Once you've been friend zoned, you can't be unfriend zoned. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. I mean. And in a special folder called Max. Oh, I don't know what's yeah, in a special okay. folder called Max. I gotcha. Are you blushing? <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. The thing is, uh, I hate to say this, but Max friend zoned him straight away, which means she doesn't like him in that way, but he likes her. So I don't. If the opportunity comes up, I think I'm going to reject Warren because she clearly doesn't want him like that. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to <laughs> it down again. Uh, I was not expecting that. That just got me then. Oh, can you use a flash drive on it? I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. No, nope, we're going to open it. We're going to open it. I'll see Max. Uh, can we not open it? I don't know, do randoms. Music. Uh, we can't open it, it doesn't matter. Yeah, there we go, that's good. Oh, we got stuck on a coffee table. So I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. I'm not, sp oh, I'm not supposed to go here, am I? I'm done in here, aren't I? Let me just quickly check. I think we're supposed to go and meet him, but I'm not sure where. 
Let me just flash drive it here a minute. I better make sure everything is still in there. Yeah, back I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Yeah. Not well, that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self respect. <laughs> well, I want to know what's in the max folder, uh, but I imagine it's not going to be pleasant for both of us. But, uh, yeah. This episode's 35 minutes long, so I kept my promise of keeping them longer. So if you like this video, hit the like, and if you want to see more Life is Strange, which I'm quite enjoying, so I'm probably going to keep doing it, even if you don't like it. But uh, hit the subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Do you not understand, Max? Do you not understand? We just fake friend her. Now she thinks we want to be friends with her. And she's going to give us free rage shit. But we're not friends with her. But we are friends with her. See what I mean? Oh, I still can't get free.